With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So we are given with a question which says a solid copper sphere uh, having density rho and specific heat as a uh, uh, C of radius R at an initial temperature of 200 Kelvin is suspended inside a chamber whose wall are at almost 0 Kelvin. The time required for the temperature of the sphere to drop to 100 Kelvin is. So we have been given with a scenario something like this in the chamber uh, which uh, the wall of which is been maintained at 0 Kelvin. A sphere has been suspended whose initial temperature is 200 Kelvin. Alright, so we have to calculate that time when its temperature reduced to 100 Kelvin. So uh, this case is a uh, case of uh, radiation and for that we can use uh, Stephen Bold Stephen's Boltzmann law or we can directly write Stephen's law uh, for in that we can write energy radiated per unit time is given by energy radiated uh, per unit time can be given as of by the formula dq by uh, let's write it as dq by uh, dt and that is equals to uh, we can write it as uh, sigma into a uh, t raised to 4 minus of t naught 4 where t uh, is the temperature of the sphere and t naught is the temperature of the chamber that is at 0 kelvin so further if we can write uh, dq can be written as in terms of specific heat capacity the energy required is mc uh, dt and that's divided by dt and that is equals to sigma a uh, t raised to 4 because t naught is kept at 0 kelvin so the answer uh, will be 0 for t naught so uh, now we can separate the variable and we can get the desired result so uh, after separating the variable we can write dt by t raised to 4 and integrating it so uh, from uh, when the temperature initially was at 200 kelvin and we have to check the time at 100 kelvin so when temperature reaches to 100 kelvin uh, that will be equals to sigma a divided by mc into dt all right so uh, these all quantities are constant so we can take it take it out as a uh, co constant and when uh, time will start when the temperature was 200 kelvin and we have to calculate the time at which it becomes 100 kelvin so let's suppose that time to be a t uh, now we have uh, we can solve it further this can be further written as sigma a uh, divided by sigma into a divided by uh, let's write it as here it would be instead of uh, mass we can write it as density into volume into c and here we will put a negative sign why because uh, we we know uh, when the uh, body's temperature uh, body is being heated so it gets expand expanded all right but when it's cool it gets contract so here in the case the temperature is reducing from 200 to 100 kelvin so uh, the temperature has been reducing so its volume will decrease that's the reason we are putting a negative sign over here i hope you have understood this now um, if we solve it further and put the limits so uh, after integration of this we will get the answer as uh, 1 over uh, 1 by 1 over 3 t cube limit 200 to 100 kelvin all right so and here uh, we can write it as minus of sigma and here it is a minus sign so uh, minus of sigma into a can be written as 4 pi r square for sphere that is area and volume uh, density can be written as rho volume can be written as 4 by 3 pi r cube into c and here it would be t only and we are interested in finding this value of t so from here uh, if we uh, solve it further so we can see uh, the value of 4 4 gets cancelled out the value of pi pi gets cancelled out 2 and 1 r is left so we are left with minus of sigma into t divided by rho and 3 will go up so let's put it over here and uh, we are left with uh, r and c so this is what we are left with over here 
so uh, when uh, year from year we can uh, also cancel out the negative sign so uh, and 1 by 3 can be taken out as common over here so we are left with 1 over t cube that is 100 cube minus of 1 over 200 cube and that is equals to uh, this could be written as 3 sigma t divided by rho rc all right so this can be uh, solved as of uh, 8 minus 1 7 uh, we can write it as 7 into 10 raised to 6 uh, divided by uh, that can be written as uh, this can be written as 8 1 za 8 8 into 10 raised to uh, 12 and this comes out to be this 3 will go years 9 t sigma t divided by rho rc all right solving it further uh, we will get the answer as uh, t can be written as uh, this could be as uh, 7 by 8 into 10 raised to minus 6 uh, into uh, 1 by 9 sigma and here it would be rho rc so solving this value uh, we will get a 9 by uh, comes out to be 0 0.09 10 raised to minus 6 rho rc by sigma so this is the final uh, time we are getting so this much uh, time uh, it will take to reduce the temperature of a, a sphere from 200 to 100 kelvin so i hope you have understood the concept and thank you for watching for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.